Blanche Monnier was a French socialite from a well-respected family in Poitiers, France. She was born on 1st March, 1849. In 1876, at the age of 25, she wanted to marry a lawyer much older than her age. She even bore a child from him. But, unfortunately, he was not to her mother's liking. Her mother tried to convince her not to marry that penniless lawyer, but failed. So one night, she made a plan with his son and set a trap for Blanche. And they succeeded to lock Blanche in a tiny room of the attic, that was located upstairs of their home. But they couldn't make her change the decision that she made, so they kept her locked in the room. And now, we must travel forward 25 years in time. On May 23, 1901, the Paris Attorney General received an anonymous letter indicating a woman was being held captive in a home located on 21 Rue de la Visitation Street of Poitiers, France. The letter read in part. Monsieur Attorney General, I have the honor to inform you of an exceptionally serious occurrence. I speak of a spinster who is locked up in Madame Monnier's house, half-starved, and living on a putrid litter for the past 25 years, in a word, in her own filth. The police were surprised that the allegations were made against such a well-respected family. But as the police were duty-bound, they didn't have a choice but to go to the Monnier estate and do some investigation. The police did a customary search in the house and found nothing, until they noticed, a foul odor was coming from one of the upstairs rooms. The police found the door had been padlocked shut, and thought there was something wrong. So they smashed the lock and broke into the room, being totally unaware about what they were about to witness, was terrifying. The room was extremely dark, and its only window had been shuttered closed, and covered behind thick curtains. The foul odor in that dark chamber was so unbearable that one of the officers immediately gave the order to break the window and to open it. As the sunlight entered, the policeman witnessed a horrific scene, and the cause of that unbearable smell. The rotting scraps of food littered the floor surrounding an old worn-out bed, in which an emicated woman was chained, who was actually Blanche Monnier, who was discovered totally naked and chained to her bed, since the time of her mysterious disappearance 25 years ago. It was the first time in over 20 years, that she had seen light. But being unable to even get up, she was covered in her own filth, and was surrounded by vermins. The 49-year-old terrified woman, who weighed a mere 55 pounds, was immediately taken to Hotel du Hospital in Paris, where doctors initially thought that she would die. Blanche's mother, 75-year-old, Madame Louise Monnier de Marconnet, was arrested the next day, and imprisoned at around 6 o'clock in the evening, but unexpectedly died after 15 days due to heart disease. Blanche's brother, Marcel, was sentenced to 15 months in prison. After the incident, Blanche Monnier did put on some weight over time, but she never regained her sanity. She died in a Blois psychiatric hospital in 1913, 12 years after she was discovered captive in her room.
That's it for today. Did you enjoy this? Then, give it a thumbs up. And if you aren't subscribed to our channel yet, then what are you just doing? Just smash that red subscribe button down there. And you'll be on your way.